Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl Sashi E. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be reviewing the new line from Maya Organics. Uh, they did come out with their Sea Moss line, you guys, and I was super excited to try out their products. Look how pretty this packaging is. Y'all, I had to show this to you guys. So before I get started, I do want to wish you guys a happy new year. I pray that this year is your most prosperous year yet. If you guys have goals and dreams and things you want to accomplish just definitely keep working hard for it and you will get the results that you are looking for another note I do want to say I am a little bit under the weather so if I sound super congested my bad just bear with me I did want to put this review out today because of my hair of course so that is why I am doing it even though I feel not that well so to get things started Started, I am going to do a thorough review of the products I did get all five of the products you guys I got an email or a text notification one of them and they were saying they had the bundles on the app for $30 y'all $30 for five products <laughs> It doesn't get any better than that so I definitely had to cop the product I also did go on Google you guys and I typed in Maya organics coupon code and I did find a code that provided me with 30% off so with the shipping taxes and everything I only paid $33 for everything and you guys that is a Deal. So first things first, I am going to go through the order of all the products as I use them. I am going to show you guys um, how I use them in the shower, of course, and give you guys my thoughts on the products. I'm also going to rate the products from one to five, letting you guys know which one was my favorite to which one was my least favorite. So yeah, y'all, let's get right into it. Alright guys, so the entire sea moss line from Maya Organics is supposed to be anti-shedding. I will say I did have a lot of shedding this wash day, but you know, I can't really pinpoint that to the products or not. I do have a little bit of a hormonal imbalance going on for one and also I did have a style in my hair for over two weeks so that could be the reason why my hair shed so much so I didn't really see the anti shedding properties working on my hair but that is what they said the line was all about so we're just gonna go with it so first things first is the shampoo you guys this was my second favorite product of this line and for their um, little spiel on the products they say this is a hydrating shampoo and I definitely think it was hydrating you guys if you guys have followed me for a while I always talk about the curl mix shampoo being my favorite and the reason why that shampoo is my favorite is because when I wash my hair my hair does not feel stripped after I use it this one was the exact same the only difference with this one and the curl mix shampoo is with the curl mix shampoo you do have to use a lot of shampoo to get your hair to lather this one a little bit goes a long way you guys y'all absolutely 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 love this product if you guys are looking for a hydrating shampoo that isn't gonna leave your hair stripped and you don't have to use a ton of it baby go ahead and get you this I think they have it at Target I think they have it on their website and also the Maya Organics app so yeah definitely get this if you guys are looking for something inexpensive hydrating but not stripping so the second product that I am going to be talking about you guys is the anti-shedding conditioner um, from the um, the Maya Organics line these products are all infused with saw palmetto um, this is supposed to be hydrating as well um, they said you'll see the difference it's for all hair types uh, mega moisture and hydration y'all this is what it says it is and because of that this is my favorite 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 product from the line as I said before when I started this wash day my hair was super dry I know I'm supposed to be a natural hair you know girl I'm supposed to keep up with my hair but y'all sometimes I cannot be bothered so my hair was in a low ponytail for about two weeks so my hair was matted my hair was super dry this brought it back to life this brought it back to life I put it on my hair I felt it going into the strands you guys like my hair felt so 
soft you guys so smooth detangling was so easy with this product this is easily one of my favorite products you guys I love this conditioner so if you guys are looking for something lightweight I think this is great for low porosity hair this is very hydrating and it's great for detangling so this was my number one favorite product from the line so after I use the conditioner I did follow up with the anti-shedding gel hair mask so this one right here was an experience as well it was my third favorite product of the line if you guys saw my review on the pattern treatment mask this gel mask and this pattern treatment mask exact same thing you guys it feels like a gel is going on your hair um, it feels nice and slippery the slip is out of this world with this product but if you guys are looking for something that's hydrating uh, this ain't really the one for you because although it feels nice and slippery when you put it on when you rinse it off it does feel I don't want to say feel stripped your hair will feel stronger it's not going to feel conditioned and highly moisturized it feels like almost a protein treatment so that's kind of the vibe that i got with this if you're looking for something that's going to make your hair feel instantly stronger this is the one for you but if you're looking for moisture in your hair and after you do your deep conditioners you like your hair to feel super nice and moisturized this isn't the product for you so this was rated the third favorite of the line also I have a review on this pattern hair mask I loved it when I did it so I will link it above in the iCard so you guys can definitely check that out so now for the styling you guys I did go in with the anti shedding leave-in conditioner okay and mm, between this and the curl pudding, I'm not sure which is my least favorite. I want to say, <laughs> I want to say this was number five. I think this is my least favorite product, you guys. This felt like water on my hair, and I didn't like that. I it wasn't super moisturizing in my opinion. As far as what she says for this leave-in to do, this awesome leave-in conditioner not only tames flyaways but detangles hair, leaving it soft and manageable, convenient and easy. It can. Be be used as a styler or to refresh curls it locks in moisture and strengthens the hair it is formulated with ingredients to control and condition flyaways for your hair <laughs> I don't know about all that y'all I was very disappointed in this product because if you guys know this I do like the Maya organics pomegranate and honey leave-in conditioners I think that's one of the best leave-in conditioners on the market and when it comes to this product I really feel like they dropped the ball with this one I feel like this could have been so much better so much more moisturizing like this legit felt like water you guys like if I spritz it in my hand you guys will see it's like water it's just it, yeah it just wasn't it for me <laughs> if you guys see this one I think you guys should bypass this product I really didn't like it at all and then last but not least I went in with the Maya organic sea moss anti-shedding curl pudding this is also infused with the saw palmetto and you guys this was like my fourth favorite well my second least favorite product um, as you guys can see with my hair it has a ton of a frizz this wasn't really the look that I was going for my hair is super frizzy this isn't something that would last me for two or three days like by tomorrow I feel like by the time I go outside and the humidity hits my hair is gonna be a fro so if you guys are gonna be using this I would suggest follow up with a gel this feels more like a moisturizer or a lotion and these are the type of results that I got um, it has no hold the hold on my hair is zero <laughs> the hold on my hair is a zero you guys you know very frizzy um, yeah it just wasn't really that great of a product so I really enjoyed like the wash day part of my routine but as far as the styling part with the leave-in conditioner and the curl pudding I definitely could have lived without it I, I just wasn't really feeling these products that well so yeah guys so that is it for today's video if you enjoyed please be sure to give me a thumbs up if you guys have any questions about any of the products that I reviewed today please be sure to leave those down in my comment section don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications I do post multiple times per week so definitely turn on your bell so you do not miss an upload from me and I'll see you guys in the next video bye